welcome back to my channel guys we're going to be working on the 2015 multiple choice question paper if you're not yet subscribed go ahead and hit the subscribe button leave a like drop a comment down below and share this video with somebody who may find it useful steamed stewed and poached foods are most suitable for the elderly because in this group a the energy intake should be reduced b basal metabolism is lower c physical activity declines or d digestive problems may be present the most appropriate answer to this question would be d digestive problems may be present the first milk a mother produces is called a plasma b albumin c colostrum or d cholesterol and the answer there would be c colostrum and as you know colostrum is the first milk that the mother would introduce to her baby right it is thicker and yellow more yellow in color than mature milk it fights infections and supports the baby's immune system and in some cases it may also prevent jaundice and this is because it is filled with lots of vitamins and minerals all right so again the answer is c colostrum which of the following is required in greater quantities by women than by men a iron b protein c iodine or d fat the answer there would be a iron and this is because women go through monthly menstrual cycles so we need that extra iron to replace that iron that we would have lost during our menstruation dietary fiber is important in the diet because it prevents a scurvy b constipation c anemia or d diabetes and the answer there would be b constipation and this is because the ultimate function of dietary fiber is to increase the weight and size of stool and to soften it thus making it easier to pass and this in fact will decrease the chances of one becoming constipated which of the following is not an advantage of a gas stove or cooker a the heat of the oven is evenly distributed b the surfaces are easily kept clean c it cooks faster than an electric stove or d it allows for economical use of fuel the most appropriate answer there would be b the surfaces are easily kept clean moving along which of the following instructions for the care and use of the blender is incorrect a rinse the goblet after use b run the motor for short periods c immerse the motor unit in warm water to wash or d wash the goblet with warm water and detergent the answer there would be c immerse the motor unit in warm water to wash bear in mind that whereas the other units or parts of the blender may be detachable like the goblet and the lid those can be submerged in water however the base of the blender which houses the motor unit should not get wet as this will cause internal damage to the blender and not only that when you plug the blender back in it may cause a spark and damage the motor system so it is advised that you do not submerge it in water but instead you can wipe the base with a damp cloth all right so this next question requires you to select more than one response and the question says which of the following are the best reasons for blanching vegetables before freezing helps to maintain color helps to keep microorganisms alive or to facilitate extended storage and the answer there would be one and three only so that's b and this is because one of the main reasons for preserving food is to stop enzyme action and microorganisms from contaminating food when bottling foods during preservation heat treatment can be carried out in the oven the sun or a water bath on the hub all right so the answer there would be one and three only and that would be c moving on to the next question which of the following information should be provided on the food label the name of the product 
a list of ingredients, the net weight, and the cost of the product. So the most appropriate answer there would be one, two, and three. So that would be C as well. Which of the following is not an advantage of convenience foods? A. Saves fuel. B. Contain chemical additives. C. Easy to prepare. D. Useful for emergencies. And the answer there would be B. Contain chemical additives. And this is because the remaining three options are all advantages of convenience foods. Next question. When cooking a cheese pastry, which of the following coagulates upon heating? And the options are A. Elastin, B. Collagen, C. Legumin, or D. Caseinogen. And the answer there is D. Caseinogen. And caseinogen is one of the primary milk proteins that are found in cheese. So this next question requires you to select more than one option for your answer. Right, so the question says which of the following materials are suitable for cooking in a microwave oven and the options there include glass, ceramic and aluminum foil and the answer there would be one and two only and that is in fact glass and ceramic. Aluminum foil would not be suitable for cooking in a microwave oven because what happens is that the electric waves that are in the microwave they tend to penetrate the foil paper and then what will happen is that the foil paper will heat up quickly and then it will eventually start a fire all right so moving on to the next question the process by which oils become a solid is known as a preservation b hydrogenation c pasteurization or d homogenization and the answer is b hydrogenation which of the following groups comprises of all spices is it a nutmeg chives mint and rosemary b ginger cloves turmeric cinnamon c thyme mustard basil cinnamon d marjoram bay leaf parsley and thyme if you selected b as your answer you are correct the group that has all spices include ginger cloves turmeric and cinnamon which of the following types of butter is used when frying poultry? Is it A, thin butter, B, coating butter, C, fritter butter, or D, binding butter? And the answer there is B, coating butter. Next question. Which of the following is not a cereal? Is it A, sage, B, rice, C, wheat, or D, barley? And the answer there is A, sage, and sage is a type of herb that is used in food preparation. Alright, next question. The main advantage of poached foods for a convalescent is that it is too fatty, not spicy, easy to digest, or D, rich in vitamins. Now bear in mind that a convalescent is someone who is recovering from an illness. So you would want to give them food that is C, easy to digest. Hazel is preparing deep fried chicken when she observed a burst of flames in the saucepan. So the question says, the temperature which the fat reached when it burst into flames is referred to as the A, flash point, B, frying point, C, smoke point, or D, boiling point. All right, if you selected A as your answer, you are correct. Next question. Which of the following persons would require a recommended daily intake of 2,500 calories? Is it a teenage boy, an overweight girl, a 10-month-old infant, or a 75-year-old woman with a sedentary lifestyle? A. A teenage boy is the correct answer. A suitable snack for an obese person is A. Papaya B. Potato chips C. Coconut cake or D. Chocolate fudge Now to answer this question, you'll be required to select the healthiest option. So for that reason, the answer is A. Papaya Which of the following is not a correct guideline for the care of a heat-resistant glass dish? Is it A. 
put the dish in a microwave oven b wash dish with mild detergent c remove food with plastic spatula or d do not put hot dish on cold surface if you selected d as your answer then you are correct so you should not put the hot dish on a cold surface and this is because this will weaken the glass and it may cause it to crack or shatter which of the following is the correct sequence for preparing green beans for freezing right and this is requiring you to look at the options that are listed there and then to place them in the order that you would use when preparing green beans for freezing right so the options include blanch and drain clean wash and trim cut into suitable sizes right and the most appropriate answer there would be C so you'd have two then three then one and in that order it is to clean wash and trim the green beans cut them into suitable sizes and then blanch and drain which of the following is not important in ensuring food safety when purchasing food is it a choose foods that look fresh b buy from reputable suppliers c check for the expiry date on packets and cans or d select expensive foods since they are of better quality and just by looking at the responses the answer there would be d select expensive foods since they are of better quality the next question is a visual one so it requires you to look at the image and then to select the name of the herb that is being displayed so is it a tarragon b thyme c rosemary or d basil and the answer there is b thyme the function of egg in fish cakes is to a bind b lighten c thicken or d emulsify and the answer there is a bind and the purpose of the egg when making fish cakes is to hold all of the ingredients together so that the fish cake can maintain its shape when it's being either fried or baked next question which of the following nutritional needs are closely linked to the growth spurt in adolescence is it a iron and protein b phosphorus and protein c fat and carbohydrates or d vitamin c and iodine and the correct answer is a iron and protein which of the following meals could be prepared using the least amount of fuel is it a stewed chicken baked potatoes tossed salad steamed custard b grilled fish baked potatoes tossed salad steamed pudding c fried fish buttered green bananas coleslaw fruit salad or d roast chicken rice and peas coleslaw and sweet potato salad if you selected c as your answer and c consists of fried fish buttered green bananas coleslaw and fruit salad then you are correct this is the only menu that would use items that do not require a long cooking time right next question bread rolls croutons dumplings and potato chips are accompaniments for a fish b soups c meats or d sauces and the answer there is b soups all right a polysaccharide present in the cell walls of fruits that causes jams and jellies to set is called a dextrin b gelatin c pectin or d cellulose and the answer is c pectin and then the final question which pieces of cutlery are correctly placed so you're required to look at the diagram look at where the items are placed and select which one is in the correct position all right and the answer there is c and c includes c and d only so that will be 
the spoon the soup spoon and the dessert spoon all right now just by looking at the diagram item b which is the fork should be on the left and item a which is the dinner knife should be on the right and then another item that is incorrectly placed is item e and item E is actually a butter spreader and that should be in a small side dish or side plate above the napkin on the place setting. Alright, so again the answer is C, items C and D only.